Hi, my name is uh, Ludovic Otterbeins. I'm the head of compound management and uh, analytical chemistry at Lundbeck. Lundbeck is a pharmaceutical company located in Denmark. And we're here today at the uh, SLAS 2015 in uh, Washington, DC. So back in 2013, we started to look at the uh, strategy of managing the samples uh, within the company. One of the key priorities from the executive uh, senior leadership teams was to deliver efficiency and uh, high performance culture. So what it meant for us in terms of sample management was to make sure that we were completely aligned with the ambitions of the screening strategies in terms of working with new contract research organizations in different parts of the world, working with more collaborators in terms of changing the collections, and also working in different strategies of how we use the collection. So those were the main drivers where we decided to look at how we manage our samples. So in terms of options for the strategy, we had um, uh, obviously looked at a fully in-source model, we looked at a fully outsource model, and we look at the hybrid model. So um, based on the quality, the speed, and the cost of the different models, we ended up with a hybrid model. So the workflow that we have set up following the, uh, the strategy review uh, is actually a hybrid model, um, by which we have totally insourced the, uh, the compound collection. So our compound collection coming from the US is now located in, uh, in Denmark. Um, we have acquired uh, TTP LabTech um, infrastructures, so the, uh, the compounds uh, which we use in the half size tube, so compound D2, we have acquired two of those. We've also acquired the uh, cover and the decaver and the mosquito to, um, to create a fully, a fully integrated workflow. So when we look at the different options um, in terms of vendors, um, TTP LabTech was definitely one vendor that would go the extra mile for us. So what they have done is really co-create um, the solution with us. Um, the advantage of the, the store compared to the, the other stores um, for us was mainly the fact that the, the moving parts, the major moving parts of the equipment are located actually outside the cold chamber. So all the maintenance and services can be done without opening the store. Um, the other advantage of the, uh, the compound TTP uh, lab tech is actually that the, moving, the smallest moving unit in the store is actually a compound and is not a tray. So we can directly retrieve compounds from one unit or we can retrieve compounds from two, three or four units. So we have um, decided to use the Mosquito STS for the, uh, the creation of our screening plates. Um, we create the mother plates using a, um, an offered um, liquid handling device. But for the replication of the mother plates, we use the Mosquito. Um, the reason for that is the speed um, of the equipment, um, also the flexibility of uh, being able to add uh, controls, the flexibility of being able to also do serial deletions uh, from the same type of instruments. So really that has had a, a big impact on how we uh, are creating our screening plates. The Mosquito has really helped us to not only deliver normal screening plates to the organization, but also starting to work with assay ready plates um, with the speed of, of delivery. Yeah, so the uh, operating model that we have in place now is, has been actually very successful. Um, what we have seen is basically not only from the uh, performance perspective, but also from the emotional perspective, having the liquid collection back at Lundbeck and being able to manage to store ourselves has had a big impact on the people and the organizations. In terms of the efficiency, we are now able to deliver things that we were not able to deliver in the past. Um, we can deliver them with high quality and also with uh, the speed and agility. So at the moment, um, the um, equipment that we have acquired, the compound, um, the capper, the capper, and then the mosquitoes are not fully integrated together. So we still have manual interventions in between those equipments. So the next step for us is really to look at the next solutions will be the full integration from store retrieval to decapping, dispensing, recapping, and back to the store. And for this, um, TDP LabTech has a new solution, which is the, the compiler. So we'll be looking at putting this into, uh, into operations and hopefully secure a business case and an investment for this uh, new piece of technology. So what we have seen in the past um, was a, a big drive from the pharmaceutical companies to outsource their activities like compound management, for example. Now that people are looking a little bit more on how the collection is being used, um, looking at how is the quality of our assets maintained, but also looking at how is the cost of outsourcing, we see more and more people trying to find ways of potentially insourcing their collection. What we have done at Lundbeck is an investment 
that in four years' times will be cost neutral and I will save money afterwards. So it means that this whole investment in four years will deliver efficiency, productivity increase, and better quality without having an extra cost in terms of the budget and without having an extra FTE to rent the equipment. So we hope, I, I believe that we will probably see more and more in sourcing in the, past, in the future due to the um, technology that is available now from the vendors.